guys, it's Delta249er here, and I am here today to show you how to compress your video um, without losing quality or too much quality. You may lose a tiny bit of quality, but it's not really noticeable to most people. Um, <clears throat> and I'm going to be using a program called handbrake it is open source which means it's free and that's always good so <clears throat> go over to handbrake.fr the link will be in the description and um, click download <clears throat> and download your version whatever operating system you're running <clears throat> I have Windows and I download that and uh, once you've downloaded and inst installed it um, come back you can pause the video and then just come back and I am going to just show you a little example. So here is the um, the footage that has gone through Handbrake, and here is the footage that has not gone through Handbrake. So I'll show you the one that hasn't. I mean, yes, hasn't. And I'm having some issues, aren't I? Okay, well I'm having some VLC problems. So that's cool. Let's see if I can get it back. All right. So anyway. It's really messing up there. Um, maybe if I make it smaller. There you go. Anyway, it's, I don't know, VLC is messing it up. Hopefully you can kind of see the footage and, <laughs> but, uh, and here it is the stuff that has gone through handbrake. And this frame skipping was not actually in the video. It was just VLC, so. But, as you can see, it is pretty clear. I mean, you can see, I mean, there are a few, but it's pretty good for the amount of compressing it does. And it's just a little demo video. <clears throat> but anyway, um, back to here. So then you want to open the software, <clears throat> and you're going to go to Source and Video File, or you can do the other ones, but usually it's a video file. And, um,. Let's see, I'll go to this, and yeah, you just select your footage, and uh, put it in there, and it's going to take a second, depends how your computer <clears throat> is, it only takes like a second, usually, I always, I always have problems, sorry, there we go, um, and then you just select your output, and you can <clears throat> you can put that wherever you want. And you can change all these settings if you want, but if you're just if you just want simple the regular default settings, which I use for most of my videos, um, then don't do don't change anything. Just hit start, and then it'll begin to compress your video. So hope that helped. Um, there's a lot of videos like this uh, on YouTube, but hope that one was helpful. Um, <clears throat> if you like this, leave a like, and uh, make sure you subscribe for more tutorials and reviews, and uh, go out and check out my channel, so see if you like some stuff. And yeah, if you have any questions, just uh, leave a comment below, and bye.